I have never been in a musical. Really? No. <laughs> I have, it's always, I was inspired by musicals and by the dancing in musicals and by Fred Astaire and <clears throat> Gene Kelly and Donald O'Connor and the Nicholas Brothers. But um, then I detoured into modern dance and contemporary dance and I, for many years, tried to bring them together in, uh, in the concert world. But f after Robin Staff commissioned us to do Showdown, I realized that performing in cabaret was an opportunity for me to actually kind of reassemble the elements of musical theater and create shows that used all of those elements, but in my terms, in a, with using everything I'd learned from contemporary dance, but the elements being off singing, uh, there's often some kind of a narrative, there's a lot of tap dancing, so I was, it released me to do whatever I wanted to, and I felt no particular constraints. It can be, I felt sometimes I was defending the forms when I was doing them on concert stages, and at Joe's Pub, I feel I just can revel in them. I can just do what I want. I tried to sneak in the use of rhythm without necessarily overtly tap dancing, because I wanted people to respond to it directly without the, the magic of the metal taps and the associations we have with the tap shoe and all of that. So that's why I made so many rhythm pieces like the Velcro piece or using toe shoes as percussive uh, devices. Body percussion, a kind of, I made up a kind of danced rhythm language, almost like an, uh, like an audible form of mime. So I was, I was working so hard to, to line up all of those things on the same network as contemporary dance that it felt sometimes like I was defending their right to be there. And <clears throat> I love that. But this has been a completely satisfying experience to just go in to Joe's Pub and know that my, what I love and what their expectations are are pretty much in harmony. I do have an affinity, a preference for movement choices, what, what we choose to do. And that, you, since we can't make much of an impact through our spatial choices, that's the way we do, and that, that's very compatible with me. Also, the forms um, are not, like the tap that we do there is not compromised by the small space. I mean, sometimes tap flies all over huge spaces, but in this case, it's quite, it can be done at its best in a space like that. And I also just realized with this one that Space, in terms of space itself as a part of my work, I'm most intrigued by the space between people and less so by spatial design. And of course at Joe's Pub, there isn't so much space between people and that is also like, no one can get too far apart. So I kind of like that. <clears throat> I like the pressure of it. Oh, me, yum, yum.